One more surge should do it. The forwards are there, the pod is gathered, and they're being pushed sideways. Yet another penalty advantage as the offside line is breached. Those in yellow desperate to find that crucial extra metre. They've found it now, but that might have been held up by Murphy amongst others. The try, though, is awarded. That's well, just that ability to ride the initial tackle and almost pirouette out of it. Myler again to nobody in particular. That's dangerous. It's loose, and Watson is onto it. And control is required here from Watson. Sliding in. Pure quality. Anthony Watson sweeping up the loose ball and delivering bar second. Earnest endeavour here from Irish, not a huge amount of punch, there's a little bit more from Blair Cowan. And Underhill's over it, Carl Dixon didn't like the way he did it. That's really poor from Underhill. The referee's clearly said no to him, he's heard it, and he's picked it up and started arguing with the referee the as he's picked it up before the referee blows the whistle. Here it goes from Myler, who's been doing it for years and years. Hoskins over the top of it, no, Bayliss is waiting out. and turning, and he's held. They do have a penalty advantage. Chudley now sends it on its way. Here's Joseph looking to exploit the spaces on the outside. His Homer pops it on its way, and Rockendanguni's in. And Rockendanguni now has 50 in the Premiership, he's been waiting a while for that one. Now having to resort to Myler, saying, no, we've gone back too many phases, let's kick it back, try and change the picture. Homer on the counter, Rockendanguni in space, trouble here for Irish. Homer and Rockendanguni set off to harass Stokes, who's leaving that very, very late, and it's been stolen from under his nose. And here comes a try, surely the That's intercept from card. Tuasui. Is it the whistle be more? is blown. And once he's won it, he's clearly offside. Would anyone else get there? It's a tough decision, isn't it? So there's a series of decisions that have been made that will really rock the London Irish effort now. Tuasui to the bin. Penalty try goes Bath's way. And that's their bonus point here at the Medeski, inside 27 minutes. Urbano, Priestland, nice weight on that pass too, and Joseph is half through the hole, gets it away for Ellis. There's Rockendanguni that might have been forwards, over the top he goes to Joseph again. Bath are all over London Irish at the moment, and Chudley will dot down for try number five. Phipps searching. Release it! Release! Stuke and Garvey patrolling. Phipps pops it back. Myler goes cross field. Uh, it's been intercepted by Homer. And he could go the length from here. Hot in pursuit is Meehan, but Homer taking his chance. Striking out of nowhere. Just about sums up London Irish's day. Myler for Stokes. This is looking a little more promising, but the tackle's coming in thick and fast. Cowan there in the carry. That's clever. Oh, lovely offloading. Great support work as well. Terrific bit of work from Alan Dell to get that close. Phipps. Offside of Bath. In go Irish. Some respite. And it's Adam Coleman in his first Premiership start here at the Medeski. He's missed touch, Myler. He's found Rockin' and Goonie. And Freddie Birds will have a crack at the drop goal. <laughs> Worth a shot. 
<laughs> Worth a shot for Freddie Burns. And the end of the contest, it wasn't much of one. A thumping bonus point victory for Bath to lift their Christmas spirits. Full time, London Irish 10, Bath 38.